Hello everyone, Argon Matrix here, welcome you to episode frickin' 50 of Let's Play Kirby's Epic Yarn, which also happens to be video, video 500 total on my channel, which is kinda cool, I guess, all the fives and zeros, it's kinda nice. And, um, before I start off with some of the mini games I have to do around here, I figured I'd explain a few things, um, really just two things. The first thing is that I actually, um, I actually just finished recording me getting the gold medal in Cloudy Palace. So, um, I'm gonna link to that on the screen right now. That's an unlisted video, so you can go ahead and click that if you want to see that. Which I know some of you probably do, some of you probably don't, so that's why I'm not including it in the main series, as I guess you could say. And, uh, yeah, that's that, so go enjoy that if you want. And the second thing is that, for those of you who did watch, um, episode 49.5, as I've dubbed it, You'll know that at the very end, Carrie actually said that she was going over to our house to visit us. And, um, normally I would just disregard that as no, no big deal, as I've done it previously. But, as someone mentioned in the comments of the last video, I forget your name, sorry. I might flash that up on the screen right now, just because it was a very useful tip for me, since I am doing this, uh, blind, so I didn't know this. But, um, Carrie, the one who's coming to visit, she, if you check here, we've actually completed all of her mini-games. Like, believe it or not, there's only 12 of hers, which is kind of sad, because hers are pretty fun. And, once you've completed all of a character's mini-game, they, um, there's a chance that they'll come to your house, to come to visit you at your house, and I'll show you what happens when they do, because a little bit of something special will happen when they do. Hopefully this still works, I don't know if she's still going to come to visit now that I've gone and visited her. She should. Yeah, here we go. There she is! Yay! Oh, so happy. I forgot how crazily I decor decorated this place. How quaint! Well, I must say you've done quite a nice little job with this place here. <laughs> nice. I have a present for you today. It's crazy cute. You're gonna love it! Oh, nice. That's so awesome, man. Look at this. You got the carry fabric. That's right. That's how you get the character fabrics for each of these uh, minigame peoples. Is by... Completing all their mini games, then they'll come and give it to you. It's really cool. I kind of like that touch. And um, I was actually checking around a little bit, and Beatrix, Buster, and Mara all still have mini games for us. But Zeke's mini game collection is actually complete too. We completed that with Dark Manor last time, so he'll be coming over to our house at some point to give us the Zeke fabric. So yay on that! We're racking up the fabrics. Hopefully, I'll be able to get 100% of those by the end of this thing. Now, we can actually get on with the meat of this video three minutes in. I know it's crazy. Um, so, we, unlo we unlocked two mini games with Cloud Palace last time, right? Mara and Buster. Someone actually said in the comments that uh, Buster gave them a lot of trouble, the Buster one in Cloud Palace. So, I think I'm going to save that for second. You know, save best for last kind of thing. You know me. You know, ALTTP, you know me. But, uh, Mara, let's see what you got for me. Reach the finish line first. I couldn't have expected any other any other way. That's amazing. Mara has like 26 plus mini games, and freaking Carrie only had 12, less than half. That's so sad. All right, uh, where is that? I'm trying to just gauge. I don't know where that is. I'll just keep going forward and uh, hope to succeed. Cause I'm a dentist and a success. Oh my god, I'm crazy. I really don't feel like doing this level, actually, because I just got off doing that whole uh, gold medal recording. At least I don't have to go and get go, go out of my way to get beads now or anything. So that's kind of nice. Just have to beat Mara at her own little thing. At her own little ditty. Get over there. Thank you. Mm, yeah, this really is... Oh, wow! <laughs> right between the two of them. That was absolutely fantastic. Okay. I was afraid I wasn't going to make that one, either. It looked like I was, uh... About to hit the edge there for a second. What can I say? Is Crackle gonna appear? This will be so funny if he does. He is! Huh? Why can't you go just zap Mara for me? That would be. Oh god, he's blocking me. Dude! Dude, that's so mean! Oh my god! Because if he hits me, then I get, like, crap. That's so horrible. I can't believe they did that. That's so scary. Mara doesn't get consequented like that. He doesn't give two shits about her. No way, no how. No, no way, no how. Uh, can you guess what I've been watching recently? Jeez. 
I made two references to it in the past two minutes. It's nuts. Mm. I actually also made a reference to it on Twitter last night. God, I loved it, though. Mm. I'm not going to mention it by name, because that's just too easy. Yeah, you take a break there, Mara. You and your craziness. <laughs> your crazy crackle avoidedness. You have, like, a cloak of invisibility or something. That'd be actually really cool. Mm. Doesn't that actually exist? Like, someone went out and invented some kind of cloak of invisibility? Like, it doesn't work the same way, doesn't Harry Potter? It's not quite as, a uh, tactile, but it's still cool. Mm. I don't know, I heard about that in the news one time, I think. Alright, wait for him to stop here and attack. And then just move on ahead without him. See ya, Cracko. Ha! Huh. Have a nice life! Is this the end, too? Looks like it should be, pretty soon. Yup, there it is! Butamus! I love how she always appears right at the last second, as soon as uh, you win. It's like the postman in freaking Ocarina of Time. Beat you by exactly one second, every single time. Mm -hmm. Alright, now that we've done that one, it's time for the apparent ever-dread of minigames. The Buster... Cloudy Palace minigame. I'm not sure what to expect from it, other than that it, uh... I've actually had a few people tell me it's hellish, not just the one person in the comments. So I can't wait to see it. I also can't wait to be king. Alright, let's see here. What do you got for me, Buster? Buster's caused me quite a bit of grief in the past, so I wouldn't be surprised if this, if this one is any exception. Here we go. It's only four stars, though. Seventy? Seventy enemies in a mi- Wow. <laughs> I didn't think the number would be quite that high. Wait, let, that's 70 enemies in 70 seconds. That's one enemy per second. Dude, how in the world am I going to pull this off? Oh, you're using the star shooter. That's how it's going to work. Okay. I catch your vibe, Buster. I know what you want here. I know what you want, but you know what I don't want? I don't want your freedom! God, that was so off-key. I'm sorry. Alright, let's see here. I figure that the best thing to do would probably just be to stay, like, towards the edge of the screen. I don't know if that really is the best. On some occasions, it might not be the best. I can see, but... I have a feeling they're gonna, have to, they're gonna make me try to hit every single enemy, which is gonna be nuts if that's the case. I'm gonna try to hit them all, just, uh, regardless. Alright, come on. Oh god, I'm so dead. Okay, man, I'm amazed I didn't get crushed there. Oh, there's, there's guys in there. I didn't even see that. That's nuts. All right, more of these guys. I think this pattern is actually a little bit different than it is in the actual level. Yeah, because there weren't crack, there weren't mini crackos in that in these areas in the freaking uh, actual level. Crap! I well, I lost beads. Not like that matters at this point, really. Does it? Dude, I only got a amount of time. Holy shit! That's demanding. Wow. Okay. I gotta step up my game a little bit, I guess. Dude. I don't even know why they let you go on so long past that time limit. Like, it's not like it matters. You're always gonna end up in the same space when you, uh, lose anyways. Due to the auto-scrolling nature of the level. Alright, let's try this again. See if I can, uh, pull it off with a little bit more gusto. A little bit more oomph. Why are those two words always paired together? Gusto and oomph. You know, it's like trials and tribulations. You can't say one without the other. Well, actually, you can say trials without tribulations. It's just, you don't really hear a lot of people say tribulations without trials before or after it in some cases. Alright. Uh, yeah, you guys are no big thing. No big stink. Yeah, I don't even, I can be pretty reckless with this too, because I don't have to worry about getting hit. Because it's not gonna really going to penalize me much at all. Alright, I can uh, blow up these guys' thing and kill them. That's useful. And every enemy counts, especially in this, because that was so... De I can't believe how demanding that was. Like, I honestly can't, man. I jizzed in my pants when I found out how demanding it was. Alright, oh, can I get all of them? Nice. Alright, get all you two. This is crazy. I missed one back there. Wait, how in the... There's... There's... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Wait, did I get it? Oh, shoot, I did it! I thought I was, like... I thought I was about to run out of time like five seconds sooner than I actually did. That's nuts. <laughs> well, okay, I guess that wasn't all that bad. Oh, but there's a new one. Uh-oh. Maybe this is the real fire of the dragon. 
You know, that was the smoke and gore, but this is gonna be the fire. The real fiery, flamey fire. That's a neat looking fabric. The yin yarn fabric, oh my god. <laughs> that must have been one monumentally tough game, and I just got lucky on it or something, because they get the yin yarn fabric. Can't even imagine. Very weird woods. Why don't I remember this level? Maybe I'll remember it once I see it a little bit. Mm, I think this is probably going to go over time if I fail on this a lot, but no big deal, you know what? Okay, we've got the UFO power up. 30 enemies in a minute. We'll see how much uh, grief this one causes. Oh, it's another auto scroller. Uh, oh, yeah, I think I do remember this. Yeah, this was. Uh, wasn't this like a bonus level? That's kind of weird. I don't know. Oh, yeah, I'm going to have to. Frick. I, now I remember this with these annoying bumpers. My name's Bumper. Oh, that was beautimous. Alright, oh, there's an enemy spawner here, too. That's kind of useful. <laughs> you know, just a tad. You know, ultimately spawning monsters in a freaking game where you have to destroy monsters that could be sort of useful. I don't know. That electricity is really useful, too. Alright, well, this doesn't seem so bad. I don't know, maybe I haven't seen the real heat, though. Oh my god, these freaking bumpers! What the hell?! That's so annoying. Alright, there we go. I need uh, two more. And these two will suffice. Cool. <laughs> so that wasn't that bad at all. In fact, we might actually get this in under my 13 minute arbitrary time limit. Well, not arbitrary, but oh, there's another one! Well, you know, I'm on a spree now. I'm on a high of Buster. So we're gonna do it. You ain't gonna bust my high today. Mm, what is that one? Is that the... That's the Fangor? I was about to say that looked like Fangor a little bit. At least from an overhead shot. I don't know, you never really see that. So you can really say Dark Manor Buster Stage at 15 and a minute 30. <sighs> Somehow I have a feeling that we're just going to have like a ton of Buster Stages in a row. And we're going to get all the boss fabrics for it. That's kind of neat how they give like the ability for Buster to give you the boss fabrics. Since he's like a... Since you bust the bosses, you know. Alright, they give you a lot of time for f 15 enemies. So, so, oh my god. So I have to imagine that this is going to be a little bit uh, precarious. How am I going to get up there? I guess I'll find out later. Uh, let's see here. How am I going to do this? Man, there's like nothing here for... Like I saw enemies back there and I have a feeling I have to get all of them in order to win this since there's so few enemies in the general level. Hmm. Alright, there's one here, yeah. I'm pretty sure I've already screwed this up. <laughs> In fact, I pretty much know I have, but I'll continue with it just to see how things are. This is, this is kind of mean. I'm just bullying these Waddle Dees. That's what it feels like. Because they're, they're just cowering in a corner, not hurting anyone, and I just have to come in and smash them. It's kind of rude if you think about it. One up here? No, but there's one up there. I see you. Ha ha. Can't hide from me for much longer. I'm gonna get you. You thought your hiding space was cool? Well, it's not as cool as my friend's hiding space from behind the garbage can. Oh yeah, I totally lost this, didn't I? Look at me. I'm, I'm missing five enemies here. Five times. Oh wait, there's one. There's another one. Okay, I, I missed three enemies. And I think I know which three, actually. Because there's nothing down there for me to get because I can't go that way. There were like a few enemies at the very beginning that I they were they looked so high up, like I couldn't even fathom how to get up there. I guess we're about to find out though. Cause I am not giving up until I get that. Come hell or high water. This is gonna happen today. I gotta pull up my bootstraps. Oh, does anyone rem remember that from Diddy Kong Racing? Pull up my bootstraps. Alright, this is how you get up here. Makes sense. Better than a sharp stick in the eye. Alright, and you are going to die, too. And I imagine there's another one up here? Uh, no. Okay. Well, then I'm not totally sure if, where, where I missed the third one that I missed. Which might be a bad scenario. Alright, I failed this, but, uh... Jeez, yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna start over. Don't wanna wait for that time to run out and hear the sad... The sad... Do, 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 do. You suck. 13, 14, yeah, I am missing one, I knew it, but where is he? Where's that Jack Munch? Well, shit. Wait, he must be down here. 
Please, 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 please. Get him. Some somewhere. 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 Uh. Okay. I still only have 14. What the hell is going on? I am so dumbfounded by my inability to find this last guy. Huh. I'm up to 20 minutes already, too. I'm gonna have to cut out some of this fail Taj. No, get the butt munch. Thank you. Well, shit. This is ridiculous, man. Why can't I find the last guy? Crazy. I'm crazy, and I know it. There's gotta be something I'm missing here. Are you an enemy buster? I will kill you. Kill you dead right now. This, I'm gonna be. I'm gonna feel so stupid once I figure out what it is you can do here. But I guarantee you that when I, once I figure it out, it's just gonna be like, okay, well, how was I supposed to know that was even there? Let me try something. Actually, this isn't gonna work, but let's see. So it would be just like them to do this. This actually works, I, I don't even know what to say. <clears throat> if this works, it's gonna be the worst thing ever, because I haven't been talking at all through this run. Somehow I feel it's going to work now, I don't know why. Wait a sec, if my math is right... Hold on, wait, 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 there's a guy here! What?! Oh, oh okay! <laughs> I could have sworn I didn't hit any other enemies. No, Buster, I'm done. I think I'm done with you for this recording session, but... I... I... I could have... You know what, there's one... God, that's gonna be the worst take ever. I, I'm so sorry for being so silent throughout all that, guys. I was just trying to concentrate. Qu Squashini fabric. Nice. Let me guess the next one's gonna be the Hot Wings fabric. I think we actually already have that, so... Mm. But you know what, I'm actually gonna check... Cause I, th I think I might know where it is, where that one enemy that I missed was. Because I, I might have heard a sound effect at some point. But I'm not totally sure, so I'm going to just go through and check. Just to make sure that I'm not crazy. I don't know. Like, I went through the level backwards, and suddenly that seemed to work. I don't know. I, like, I thought... I didn't ex exactly intend to go through the level backwards. What I was thinking is that maybe, like, if I skip all the enemies here, there's gonna be an enemy, like, at the very end of the level that just disappears if you take too long to get there. Alright, but right here, this is where I think there might be something. Because I think I, th I threw this guy o over this way, and I think he might have hit something. He did! Look at this butt munch up here, hiding in a... F uh, that just grinds my gears. That's so freaking cheap. I was jumping in every dark corner, too, too trying to figure out if there was one up there. And that's the one I omitted, and it turned out to be the one of sweet justice. Good lord, what a... <laughs> this has been the weirdest 50th episode ever. Anyways, um, next time I guess we'll continue with our Buster-thon here. Or maybe not, we'll see how things go. So, um, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks everyone for watching. This is Argon Matrix signing out. Thank you and good night. God, 
33 minutes of recording. You gotta be freaking kidding me. This is ridiculous.